Hello again everybody, Sebastian Keynes here with another Watch Your Rooms video. Well, guess who showed up in the public server? The Hellfire Emperor. Now, he and I met in the Forerunner server. But he did kind of get me there because I didn't have the roster. But in this time, we certainly knew how to tackle it. So for those of you that are looking to tackle this content or improve on it so you can get a little bit more of the coins that you can use in the in the shop to possibly get the hammers or get the engines uh summoning crystals that are available there uh, there was i had a pretty good idea of what was going to be required to make sure that we could get the best possible score based on the fact that number one we knew that we would be re regenerating our health. Also, while the enemy would be losing theirs as they uh, came across the, the 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 path, right, going through the emperor. And at the same time, our main goal was going to be to detain them as long as we could, to hold them back, make sure that they lost their HP before they got to the emperor. So, in terms of trying to tackle this out. Definitely, we're going to need our defenders, and those are the ones that we were toying around with primarily. And as you can see here, I did have the roster for me to be able to test this out. And as it was found out in the Forerunner servers, the tanks or the defenders that were going to be the best for this content were going to be the ones that gave themselves shields. And if you had somebody like uh, uh, King Hars or a Soldi to give you that extra boost, especially for the Northern faction, you were going to fare very, very well in this content. Now, for the Forerunner servers, I uh, was pretty limited on what I could do there, but Cerberus was serviceable. He did a phenomenal job there, along with Baron, is another one that I use. I did not have Titus leveled up in that account, uh, but he actually has been found to be very good. You just have to give him the stats to make sure that he does hold up during the battle. He's one of those that you're probably going to want to focus more on HP than try to give him defense. Livian does well if you have her uh, leveled up. Uh, she can hold on her own. She doesn't last as long as um, uh, the character, as the heroes that you see here on the bottom, but she can do very well for, especially if you have a free-to-play account. Just to kind of give you an overview of what you can do. I tried Acer. My I really did. I wanted him hit. to work. Unfortunately, I couldn't get him. He does have that little shield that he gives himself. I tried to balance his HP, his defense, I tried to make him work, we tried to get him a place in the game. Unfortunately in this one he's not going to be the most reliable hero, but if you do have him, put him into two HPs with one defense and uh, in terms of the, the gear, and he might actually work for you and try to at least get you SS, uh, maybe SS plus if you have other heroes that you can you can put around them but yeah uh, yeah i tried we tried uh to make that fella work give him a place but it didn't work uh constance i wouldn't use uh she for me anyway in, ter in terms of all the gear that i had and i was going back and forth and putting on her i wouldn't i wouldn't use her for this she's primarily more for uh, somebody that can support units that are around her than her being a tank herself Oren, uh, uh, just to not even talk about him uh she uh she heals uh her herself as well besides the 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 stage regenerating her health unfortunately it's because of the her uh, i think it was nothing. her uh let me see here yeah her her base hp is too low uh, to really try making her survive for as long as we as we need to for this this uh, battle so but if you are limited and you need somewhere to go yeah so baron of course he has a shield uh and he has the the invulnerability uh that you can um take advantage of if you need him and i know that i've seen some comps on the top uh 100 that have used baron uh in service uh they can do very well 
but this is the one that we got to work and of course since i have captain reed we gotta use them i mean when like we don't use them enough in another country but i had to bring them in and of course i did go with all the heroes in the northern faction now for oh, king hearts shield. i did give him a guardian set and i tried to bump his hp as much as i could and give him as much defense as possible I really thought that maybe attack speed would come into play with some of these heroes, especially if you want them to make sure they got to their ultimates. And so I, I did try to squeeze in attack speed as much as I could, but you don't have to. Uh, some of these guys will do fairly well without it. You know, and, and then you have the true tanks, you know, the ones that are just going to be boulders there. Uh, don't, yeah, don't give them attack speed. Just focus on the HP and defense as much as possible. Same thing here with Broker. Uh, I really did bump him. I wanted him to be the wrecking force for at the beginning uh, to to try to make sure that he held up as much as possible, and I wanted him to survive us for as long as he could. So yes, ten thousand HP, ten thousand defense, a uh, hundred thousand HP, ten thousand defense is what I settled on on him. Ah, sucking hearts. Uh, same thing with uh, Captain so. Reeb. Um, you, you're gonna notice that the, the at least for him I wanted as much HP as possible on him he was one of the first ones that was falling behind but I really wanted to make sure that he did survive as much as possible of course uh, um, if he kills the enemy he gets attack speed but in this case remember the enemies are dying on their own he does inflict slow so he is very good for this uh, so for those of you that do want Captain Reeve uh, to come back soon, I understand. He is very good for this content. Uh, like I said, it, um, the other one that we brought into the battle, and I did have her leveled here. Perfect. We tried Aveline. And Aveline, of course, is because she has the four block already given to her. And in the gear, I did do mix and match here because I was just looking for the best pieces that had HP and maybe some defense on her. And for her, I actually gave her a little bit of rage regions so she, she could cycle back as much uh, as possible. Uh, get that stun, slow everybody down. So that's how I decided to use her for this. And, and remember that her defense increases permanently so that's why i focused a lot of hp on her build over defense okay um sorry for all the clicking but that's just to kind of give it so if this is building up just make sure you give her as much hp as possible it's all the it's all the same thing um i tried to focus more on her hp because do remember that uh, her talent gives her a boost on defense every time that she blocks so that wasn't a big concern in my Make regard then all like i tried to balance them out a little bit uh, but if eventually I did reach a, a little bit more of a threshold to, to lean on the HP and the defense, but you can see, you kind of saw there that there was a little bit of a balance. And Oleg is one of the ones that I just went three rings of HP on him. Adeline, I, same thing, should be the same thing. It's all HP. That's correct May for her. Asaldi, HP, because she has her own defense that builds up. And I think that was it, right? So one, two, three four five and six um let me see yeah king hearts is all hp this is the one this is the one to try to get things balanced out where i did use one defensive ring uh that had an hp substat in it so that allowed me to get that 10 10 that you saw there and then with they captain reeve again all hp so do take some of the other heroes that you do have in your account try to balance the hp and defense if you can i luckily did in this account did keep some defensive pieces that i could toy around with and that's why i started experimenting and trying to balance it all out if you're curious about the artifact i knew that we were gonna have to whore bastion rings uh when i saw this content release in the forerunner server so every single one of the defenders that i use for this battle has a bastion ring not all of them are leveled but what i decided to do is give the stronger bastion rings that i had to the defenders that i perceived to be the weakest when it came to the builds so that's why you see Aveline and Asoldi having evil. the more level best of rings than Oleg, Reeve, Captain Mars, and uh, Broker. 
so that's kind of the kind of the um, ideas that I can give you in trying to build this to make sure that you can get the best possible score and you can get into the rankings to get these um, uh, little coins um, that you can use at the shop I am going to leave you folks uh, with the auto run that I think that is saved from the highest score just to give you an idea of where I place the tanks you can see here that Oleg and Broker are the ones that I put up front I put the bricks up front that was my idea there then I put King Harz here because I knew that, that he could do a little bit of damage along two with holding the back same thing with Adeline here and then I just put Asoldi and Captain Reeve here as the last lines of resort uh, to hold and try to get rid of anything that might have uh, leaked through the, the, the two boulders here up top. This is the strategy that I use. I've seen others where they have kind of fortified this side here and then they come in and kind of uh, place these two tanks down here and then put the last one here to kind of try to block anything that might leak through here so you put kind of a strong you strong defender up here you, you what you perceive to be your two, two weekends ones and then you fortify this side here if you want to if you want to try that you can do so play around you know with the heroes that you have uh, my suggestion though is put your bricks what are your defenders to be known to be bricks put them up front try to block as much of it as possible before they get to these i think that in my runs captain reed was going down first and then Adeline was going uh, let me see what happens in this run here uh, they're holding up pretty well so far right now but i yeah so there goes reed He's the first one to run down. That's why I would really try to hike up his HP as much as I could, just to make sure that he would hold it for me. But the left side is the side that went down for me. So that's kind of the um, the how I decided to tackle it here in the public server, knowing the type of heroes that I had. And as I showed you briefly in the free to play account, if you want to go see that video, kind of the 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 epic. Uh, tanks that I decided to use for that content there and to try to to get the best score possible there so if you have your northern tanks use them they're the best ones for this content and so um, I hope that you are able to uh, get as much of the um, as, as many of the coins that you can out of this boss right with that folks I will leave you there uh, thank you very much for tuning in and watching and remember as always hit like and subscribe if you do want to see more watch your realms content in the future and until then we will see you in the next video together we are the shield